Hey, look, everybody. Chuck built a clock. Chuck built a clock. But it's got a huge problem. It doesn't work. So, guys, I think what we're going to do is actually build a clock. How about that? How about that, guys? You want a clock? You want a clock? I want a clock. I think the island needs a clock, don't you? I don't see no clocks. How am I supposed to tell? How many minutes going by? I need some countdown time. Chucky Poo and it's countdown time on the island, yeah. Well, is... Is this a clock? No. That's not a clock. Is this a clock? Ooh. This? No. Hey, do you, do you know what time it is? Do, do you guys know, know what time it is? No? Is this a clock? Hey, String! String! Do you know what time it is? String! Man. Nobody knows what time it is. I could ask this guy. Do, do you know what time it is? Is that a no? Ooh, I could ask this guy. Hey, buddy. Um, I was, I, I was kind of, whoa. Um, I was just wondering what time it was. Um, I don't know how many minutes have counted down or anything. Whoa, looks like you got your own problems. Oh, no. Hey, do you guys... Do, can you tell me what time it is or how many minutes have passed? Uh, what? What is wrong with you? You want to help a guy out? Jesus. Give him one more try. So, do you know, like, if it's been eight minutes or... Or how many minutes there have been? Go. You know what? Screw you, man. Nobody knows the time around here. This is bull crap. Well, I finally found a clock, but I don't know how to read it. So, it doesn't really help me. Hmm. Well, it turns out uh, I looked at my footage of my first recording of the first section, and uh, yeah, um, it didn't, uh, it didn't go down right. Uh, it was all weird. And I had to delete it, so we'll just go like this and show this much of it. Hey, look, I got the first section done. The first section's all done now. Yay, first section. All right, and we are back, and I got the next one in. So, if you come up here, I'll show ya. Wait, what do I need? I need that. So, this took about another couple hours, I would say. Probably about two hours for each section I've put in so far. We got the one right there and the new one right here. And it's basically the same kind of piston tape thing that we had in the first one. And I'll turn it on. And we'll get out of here because it's super loud. And as you can see, it counts down 60 seconds now. So every time that switches to zero, you get a switch right there. So we now have a minute timer. And I just got to put the last section in, and we'll have a nine-minute timer right here. And it's actually only going to be used for eight minutes for what we're actually using it for. But it should be good. It should be awesomeness. Well, I'd love to tell you what we're doing, but not yet. Not yet, says Chuck. Chuck says no. Not yet for you. Goodbye. Hey there, everybody. Chucky Poo is back. Chucky Poo is back, and he's twerking on a queen head. Yeah, baby. All right. I was tooling around over here last night, and Minecraft Jesus came down and blessed Chuck. Minecraft Jesus came over here, blessed Chuck. Chuck uh, was tooling around, and well, bam It's done. It's done, everybody. Look at this beautiful piece of crap. It's so great. It'll count down nine minutes, because that's what you need to know is a nine minute. How what what has gone down in nine minutes? That's pretty much what you need to know, right? 
So you set her at nine minutes. Throw the switch. Probably get all lagged out. <laughs> Doesn't seem to be too bad there at all, really. And yeah, she functions. She is fully functional, which is beautiful. We actually have a purpose for this, so purpose for this in the bar situation here. Um, I'm still not going to tell you what it is. I'm not going to lie. Not going to tell you what it is yet. We still got some things to work out over here. Um, what we really need to do is to put in an automatic brewer. We need to set some redstone lines coming from this contraption to where they need to be. And then we will be pretty much on our way to what we planned to do here. So I guess I shall get back to you shortly. Yes. Chucky is the greatest. Chucky just built a digital clock in Minecraft. Yes, he did. Because he is the greatest. A little more twerk. Dang, dang, dang. She sure is beautiful. But I thought I'd give you a quick rundown of how it really works here. I mean, I can't really fully explain it all here, but I'll give you a quick run through. Basically, you can set the minute time, the every 10 second time, and these whenever you would like to. So basically, you can set that to whatever you would like to. It'll be uh, connected so we can actually turn on a button over here and it'll kind of set it because it's going to be used for something specific. And we can turn this on. Let me, let me do a little bit of this real quick, though. Yes, it gets pretty loud. So we will pillar up here, and I can really show you the inner workings of it. Basically, you can see all the redstone fires through the entire system. And what it's doing is pist pushing this piston tape around in a circle. And basically, every time you can see that uh, the wood is in front, it sends a signal. And when the glass is there, it, it, it like kind of pauses the signal. Which, uh, when the wood's there, you, get, you, you can actually see the light. And when the glass is there, it actually turns them off. And it's set up in such a way that it displays numbers. And that's basically how you're getting uh, signals out of the redstone lamps there. And it's pretty crazy, man. Like, this guy runs as a second clock. This guy runs as every 10 seconds. It'll go once. And then you just saw that fire. And every once, every minute, this one will fire. So basically, it's just a countdown timer that can be set for up to nine minutes. I believe we're going to use it for seven for something specific. And uh, it's going to be really amazing. <laughs> what we're kind of using, our whole build over here is kind of just pointless. But this is the kind of things me and String love doing. Like, just really technical redstone stuff. Really crazy builds that are in survival. You know? Like, this stuff ain't this stuff ain't easy to do at all. Very difficult. And, I mean, it's just a rotating piston thing that ends up displaying numbers, which is just amazing to me. Jump back down here. Take a look at her. Count it down, baby. Count it down. Four, three, two, one. Zip, zip. Six, fifty-seven, fifty-six, fifty-five. I am a genius. All right, everybody, and we are back for the ending. You see that? I mean, I was walking around asking people what time it was, asking all sorts of things. Creeper blew me up. Skeleton shot my face. 
found a clock, couldn't read it, went and built a clock, and now I can see it with my own eyes, and I don't have to ask anyone for any time measures. I can count down all the time that I can handle. All I gotta do is clickety click click, reset that thing, and watch the time go by. Watch it fly by. You know what I'm saying? Chuck handles business. Chuck's a business handler. And let's take one more go. Oh, she's a beaut. Look at her up there in the sky. She's a beaut. She's a beaut. But until next time, we will get the rest of the situation figured out with the bar, the whole bar setup and the situation over there. And we will be back to you next episode with probably the end product. So we will see you then. Bye-bye.